Hi there, Richard Matt. That was fast. That was, whew, ninja style. Uh, Richard Matharu here, and uh, I want to teach you one simple change you can make to your marketing of your network marketing business that will transform and improve your results. I've got that tip for you today in this video. I'll be right back. Stay tuned. Okay, welcome back. So let's just dive straight into the content and that tip. There are two drivers that really kind of dictate every behavior that we take as human beings, pretty much all of it, right? And that is character, what you think of you, and reputation, what will other people think about you, right? Now, in this day and age of social media and you know, fake it for you, make it, and all that crap, right? It, it's very much towards the reputation end of the scale, right? Everyone's always thinking, what will this look like if I if I take this picture, if I post this? And don't get me wrong. Like, people will still... Oh, I'm going to wrap it here. People will often do things to inspire others. They want to help other people. They do it with a good feeling. But often it's not. Often it's just getting dragged into this, like, cycle of got to look good, got to look good, got to look good, regardless of whether you feel there's any truth in the matter or not. See, when I first came into network marketing, that's what I saw a lot of. And I wasn't familiar, not familiar, well, I wasn't familiar, I wasn't comfortable with it either. Like, stretch the truth, Richard. You can say this business is fantastic. Well, it's not fantastic. Yeah, but they, you know, they never said a result, you never said an amount of money, so it's up to them what they take from it. I was like, yeah, but I, I know they're taking that that's financial results, so even if I never said it, I'm not comfortable with that. And we see this all the time. How often do you ask somebody, how's business? Oh, it's amazing, it's fantastic. It's a fountain of youth, it's spectacular. And you're like, I haven't seen you on a leaderboard. I haven't seen you on an incentive. I haven't seen you rank advancing. So it isn't fantastic. Just call a spade a spade and cut it out. Because now I don't trust you. Now I don't believe you. Now I'll never join you. Because how am I supposed to trust anything else that comes out of your mouth? And that's the same way people are looking at you if you're stretching the truth in this way. With your conversations, with your marketing, with your social media, with whatever else methods it are that you're using. See, what actually works best and the change that I want to encourage you to make is to tell the truth always because it's good enough and think about what's important to you, your character. See, we are the most intelligent species on the planet for a reason, and that's questionable when you think about some of the people we know, right? But we are. You stick us in a cage with a lion, a tiger, a bear, a poisonous snake, like, I'm dying within, within 60 seconds, right? So are you. But if we have an hour to prepare, We'll craft a weapon, maybe we'll put some poison down, don't even have to fight, because we've got the brain, we've got the skills up here, right, where it counts. So we can tell when someone is lying. We can tell when something doesn't match up. Your prospects can tell when you're weaving them an untrue story. So cut that rubbish out, because it just doesn't work. It's good enough to say, how's business? Well, you know what? I've only just started. I haven't signed anybody up yet. But you know what? For the first time, I'm passionate. I've got my spring back in my step and I have a clear path to where I am, to where I want to be with some good people around me to help me or encouraging me and actually want to see me win. Now, is that not a powerful message? You may say, well, it's not as powerful as make a million dollars this month. It's more powerful. You know why? Because it's the truth. And the truth is always better than fiction. It is. It always is. Because people can feel it. How many people do you know, maybe even you before getting into network marketing, lacked any kind of direction, any kind of plan, losing passion, didn't have a good group of people around you, right? Or all or one of those things. So these are desires of the people that you are looking to bring into your business. So why not play to those strengths and what is important to you? If family is important to you, speak on that. If money is important to you, speak on that, whatever, but tell the truth. This message will fit you like a glove because it's your own personal message. People will see you standing outside of all the idiots who have got dragged into spouting off about what they're doing. And I saw a guy the other day in the airport, we went to Italy, and I thought, is this what the world is coming to, right? He was taking a selfie in the airport with the planes in the background. Fair enough, right, if he wants to do that. But he had this fake watch. I could see it was a fake. And he's and he's like, he's trying to get, he's like, like this with the picture. Trying to do it about 20 times, trying to get the watch in. I'm like, I'm like, are you selling watches? He's like, no, I'm not selling watches. I'm like, oh, and I walked away because at that point I thought there is no point. This guy's selling watches. Okay, it's his product. It's his brand. I get that. But if he's not selling watches, what the hell is he doing? 
Like, I have a watch. I, I'm, I am somebody. I've been... I mean, it's a fake watch. I can tell. I could see it close up. Maybe on the camera it didn't come across. I'm looking at it. I'm like, that is that is cheap, fake. It's not real gold. It's. It, I mean, what are you doing? Is that the way we're judging people these days? Is that what we think we're, we're... Is that the pool we want to fish in for our network marketing business? Is that the way we want to contribute to things? Like with our fake watch? Why not talk about things that are important to you? If it's watches, it's watches. But that guy was... I just... I would never trust another word that guy said. Maybe I'm judgmental. Probably, yeah, I am a little bit. But you know what? What does that say about somebody? If the initial message they want to send out to the world is one of something that's fake, one of something that he probably doesn't even care about, and that most of the people don't either. I mean, we just need to have more substance in what we do in this industry. And if you do that, you'll see some amazing changes about the way people treat you, your business, your success, and the results that you actually get in terms of signing people up because that trust, rapport, and skill set becomes very, very apparent. Next time you have a conversation, next time you're going to post something, whatever you're about to do today, think about your character and the reputation will take care of itself. Because when you stick to your character, people will follow you. They'll share your content. They'll want to put your message out there. They'll want to say, hey, go follow that guy or, the, or girl. They'll want to promote your business. They'll want to join you. And that's when things get really cool and really interesting. And it all starts with you and your behavior for the right reason. So I hope you've gained something from this video. It's kind of a little bit different, I guess, than what most people teach you in network marketing. But it's really, really important. I'm sure we can agree on that. Let's not contribute to all the rubbish that's in our industry. Let's contribute to the growth, specifically in your businesses where it can start. As always, go create a day in life that counts. Always have more desires and excuses. And if you want to kind of get more of my training, of course, subscribe. I do four of these videos a week. Uh, but I have a webinar for you at richardmathrew.com forward slash YouTube. If you go to richardmathrew.com forward slash YouTube, you can pick a time. I'll be there. I'll teach you a whole bunch of stuff more than what I know uh, that has been in the field, responsible for over a million pounds of sales in other network marketers and me sponsoring over 700 people. I'll teach you that stuff for free. I'll see you on there. Bye for now.